Hello, humans and pets. What do we have today? We have whatever's in the bag. First Ooh, of all, we mystery, have a mystery product. bag, which is the title of the video. Oh, is it? Probably, right? Left and right Twix. Um, I need your phone. It's plugged in over there. Go get I gotta it. go get the phone. Thanks. All right, so today, right. also with that, I went and Ryan's gonna have to grab the receipt. So when I was going through the snack aisle, they had Nutter Buddies, which I want to say were three dollars and something cents for the box, or they had the Walmart brand of peanut butter bars wafers. So we've decided to go on a theme that we've been going on. Is the Walmart brand better or worse than the actual one? The receipt's right there that's folded up. Um, and we can give you the actual prices. I, I want to say it was like a dollar something and like three something when I bought them, but I'm not 100% sure. $1.34. For the Walmart. Yeah. And two fifty eight. $1.34, $2.58. So yeah. are they better or are they worse or are they now, the same? We got a left and a white, white Twix in this bag. And it says that the right Twix is enveloped in chocolate and drizzled caramel with a crunchy cookie inside. Um... What do you want to do and first? It's sweet Twix? and crunchy. Left Twix is coated in chocolate with cascaded caramel and a crispy cookie. So the definitions are different. We're gonna see if it tastes any different, looks any different. Let's just Smells be honest. And it was a promotional thing that sucked in little kids like running. But yeah. all right, according that's left. There is a difference. So we're gonna see. Yep. For you silly millennials that watch these commercials. Oh my goodness. Try not to break the bars. That's that's the right one. All right. Okay. So take give me, it. Give me a right. Is this right? Yep. Yeah, grab it. That says right on the bag. All right. This one tell. says left. You're hiding it. Right. See left. All right. So right left is left. in front. Right is in back. How about you just put right is right. Here's the right. Normal Twix. I'm gonna put them left and right so I won't it mistake is them. the left. Looks the same. I don't like Twix. Really? Yeah. So left. Me. I actually don't mind Twix. Mm -hmm. I, on the other hand, like Twix frozen. No, left has is a um, is coated in chocolate with cascaded caramel. So the All camera's right. cascaded. We're going right. This camera's drizzled. Mm. Tastes exactly the same. You think? Mm hmm I got more caramel on my lap from the cascade than the drizzle. All right. Only he would actually try to argue this point. I'm not kidding. It's Look. a marketing thing. They're exactly the same. The whole top is filled with caramel. He bought them both. And then this one. Only these three lines. Exactly the same. No, only okay, he would, There's way less caramel on my right than my left. Only he would fall for this falling. But he, not, he bought them from the store the other day. You can see the difference. They're exactly the same. Let's try the left. It's all across the top. So, right. And it's not. It is. All no. across the top. No, not mine. You might mix them up. No, I put left and right. Exactly the same. Both delicious. Wait. Left, right. Wait, what? I don't know. What? What did you want me to do? Mm -hmm. They're good. Not bad. They're the same. They taste the same. Mm -hmm. No. It's time for the game. Oh my god, you're really gonna make me freaking blindfold? Left or right twice? Which one are you eating? They're the same. Put it on. It doesn't matter. But if you get it, then it can't be the same. If you know which one you're eating. I'm not gonna know. No, I'm gonna the test same. this one. 
You can't see nothing. I know. I can't see anything. So? It actually hurts my eyes. I gotta keep them shut because otherwise it touches my eyeballs. <laughs> I'm gonna use this one. Why do I have to put the blindfold on? You? Why don't I have you do it? Because I want you to go first. I'm not gonna. Okay, I broke it in half. Now open wide. Okay, it's like a twitch. Okay, left or right. I have no idea. They taste the same. I'm gonna say right. You got it. You know why? Because right is always right. I don't know how you got right. Why wouldn't That's you? That's impressive. All right, now close your eyes. Okay. All right, you're gonna do it. I I don't deserve it. You're gonna make me much. do it. So I didn't. I was... Yeah. See, on. I can open my eyes Hold and it doesn't hurt. <laughs> Left or right? Make sure you show them. Like the bag. All right, you ready? Oh! 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 You got a full twix. Not the bed. I don't want that one. Ready? Open up. <laughs> it's a full of twigs. I don't want it. Come on. Open up. We don't get time for this. <laughs> oh my god, you're spinning it out. <laughs> definitely a right twist. Yeah, it was definitely a right twist. I just gave you the other side of mine. <laughs> so silly. Um... It doesn't matter. They taste exactly the same. Yeah, they're, they're very alike. It, it just, it's a marketing scheme, and it's a good marketing scheme because it gets people like him to think there's actually something different and buys them. I do think but, they, it did follow the description on mine. I am. But Twix is a Twix. I won't see myself like probably ever buying those again. You, you bought them this time. So but, This was the more, I, I was kind of curious on... Is Walmart better or is it the same? Now, Nutty Butters are great. We, we used the Nutty, nutty, wafers nutty Buddies. Nutty Buddies we're a fan of. Yep. So. Wow, you can't even tell the difference. Do you want to show? Buddy? This one's the fake one in the left hand. Ryan's left hand is the fake one. Oh, okay. Shouldn't say fake. This is the Walmart version. It's a little Debbie. Right. But you can see it's more uniform on the crisscrosses and it's a lighter shape. This one looks like they copy and pasted an image of the crisscrosses. These are actually indented. These really aren't. But, kind of cool. So, so Nutty Buddies it. peanut butter bars. And they are twice as much. I mean, neither one of them are expensive because it's like you don't have to just open them, Ryan. I got a dog that can't eat chocolate on my lap. So, open them. These are Nutty Buddies, right? Nutty Buddies. Okay. By Little Debbie. And put them on my left. And put them up top. All right, well, you do what you want, but I don't know why you didn't open them and you just hand me the bag. Not for fit. <laughs> I will say the Walmart version has a darker version of chocolate. Oh, it just looks and it looks bigger. Not at all. Yeah, it looks bigger. It's like smaller. to look at my two. Mine is smaller. It's definitely a darker version of chocolate and looks bigger. It is smaller. It's got a whole bottom edge. It's bigger. It's smaller. No. Oh, maybe taller wise, but it's wider. No. The same width. No, it looks it looks it looks the acre and chocolate. Let's eat it. Hundred percent. Which one? Nutty buddy. Nutty buddy. Nutty buddy time by little Debbie. Hmm. Just like I remember them. Hmm. These were some when I bought the other day. I didn't have a fear of them actually going because they're just a happy little wafer with a little buttery peanut butter flavor and chocolate. I'm gonna say that. I'm seeing nothing wrong with them. Pretty good. Now, for about a buck less. Yeah, it's half price. It's almost for half price. Is one I get? Let's see. I've never seen these at Walmart before. In fact, they had another Walmart brand of like a peanut butter cake I almost bought. But I didn't have anything to compare it to. Mm. No. Mm. 
What are you knowing? Nobody close to my cousin. Well, I'm getting more of a peanut butter flavor. It's the wafer that's doing it for me. I, I think I like that one better. Let me go back. I will give you the Nutty Buddy is light and airy. With more chocolate. Way more. And these might have a slight more crunch. But I get more peanut butter. Because there's less chocolate. But it's a darker chocolate. It's just a color different. Again, you're entitled to your opinion. I 100% would buy the cheaper one. I think they taste better, actually. Or just as good. If not better, they are so close in, in, in everything. You wouldn't notice if you weren't eating them back to back like this. Mm-hmm. I will give you the wafer on the nut up, buddy. Literally melts in your mouth. Yeah. Let me see if this one does. Mm. No. Not the same. It does. I, I, I go. The chocolate's a little different. I, again, he, he'll disagree, but I, again, would say 100%. Buy the Walmart version for half the price. I think you'll be just as happy. If you do side by side comparison, I'll say these wafers seem just a slightly bit fluffier. I almost think there's more peanut butter flavor in the in the Walmart van. Either way, six of one, half a dozen of other. For half the money, I would definitely buy a Walmart again. I'd double it and get the nutty buddies. Stay away from great value. Yeah, but you see, you guys said that about the uh Pinwheels. Pinwheels, and you ate them both like they were nobody's business. Well, your I haven't had one did. since that day. Your mother probably did. I have not eaten a pinwheel since And I before. And I agree. I thought they were just as good, so. but they were half price. So um, I, I think these are in the same boat. I, I don't think there's that much of a difference where I would spend the since dollar. Since I'm so used to the Nutty Buddies, mm -hmm. and I don't want the other one. Well, there you go. But again, it's it again. They're not super expensive. They're only three something for these compared to and a dollar something for a big. I think they're yeah. six dollars to like a dollar ninety nine or something like that. Something. When, when I switch, yeah, I was close. So, but um, overall, overall, we learned two valuable lessons: right twix and left twix are the same exact candy, practically. Um, and one's better than the other, or maybe not. So go give both of these a try. Um, these, what well, I was excited for. You know, I know you were excited for. I, I was pretty much, it was just a marketing scheme, but. No, I, I do think if you could pick one, right? Not to get political or anything. You're, you're right. But right tricks or left tricks, which one would you go for? Whatever was on the aisle, it doesn't matter. They which one did exactly I say the, the, the drizzled? I liked right. I like the yeah, try this one. This one is something. Do you remember what it is? The Don't look. Because I gave it to you. Oh, well, you shouldn't have looked. Because I gave it to you. I just had the other half. Well, eat it. I don't really like them. <laughs> he says, go get them. I, they're identical. Much like these two. I, I think these are pretty close. Uh, but again, Walmart brand is half price. So mm -hmm. if I'm going to ever buy them again... I would go half price again. I would buy them. I was just curious. I don't ever remember seeing a Walmart brand next to them. And they were actually on the shelf next to them the other day. And I knew it was one of the few candies that... Or whatever you want to call them. Cookie candy. Whatever they are. That I don't actually mind eating as much Bars. as... Yeah. So I didn't think these would stay in a cabinet all that long. Like some of the other things we buy. Like um, what? Like chocolate crispers that we still have down there. 
Oh, no. Or any of the other I forgot about the strawberry things biscuits. that are in there. I ate like four servings of that the other day, though. Yeah. Where these these Not aren't bad. actually bad. So I, I, I said, I'm going to pick them up and see if, if they compare. You know, yeah. do they taste the same? But overall, there you go. There is our is Walmart better review, I guess, or whatever Stats he decides. What's in the bag review. Yeah. Whatever he decides he wants to title it. Uh, um, does right or left twist matter? Now, right is 100% left twist free, to be fair. Don't get me wrong. I, I love their advertisement. I like their promotion and I, I like the their advertisement. And it's it, it is well, left Twix is in the dude's pocket. Right? It, it makes it, left it makes people think, you know, like is there so really funny. a difference? No, it's not. So it, it they didn't they used to or is that Kit Kat? They used to be stuck together. I don't remember. It must have been Kit Kat. We actually had to break them apart. They still do that. Is it Kit Kat? Yeah, you break it apart. Twix. I've I've never been a Twix guy. Like, if I was going to buy a candy bar, I bought a Snickers. I don't know why. I'd get a Reese's Break 5. Is that what it's called? Fast? Take, take 5. Take 5? Take Those five. were good. Mm -hmm. That's the pretzel and the whatever. The they didn't have that back in the day. But like, if, 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 if my mother was like, pick a candy bar, good. I would go with like peanut M&M's because you could make them last forever. Peanut M&M's. Or a Snickers because they, it just felt like... I'd get some Warheads up. way first. Before and just, that was just me. And, and right. did that ever happen? Icebreakers. Probably once in my lifetime. It never ever happened. So it wasn't something we did. So I would never just buy Twix. I never just bought yeah. Twix. That's something that came in Easter candy or... or, or, or which Halloween Three Musketeers was always superior. No, it wasn't really. I don't know if Three Musketeers ever came my Easter basket. But like, like Halloween. No, I mean Halloween. Yeah. Like, Three Musketeers is superior compared to Twix. No, it's not. Not even close. Oh, Three Musketeers is your was. suck one that you eat at the end when you ran out of candy. According, it's dots to you. No, I throw them, I asked, I throw like, them right in the trash. I asked like 15 people. I had one person say that they're all right. And the rest really like dots. No, I thought they were. I, I thought out of I all the amazed, chewy candies, you know? they were like the most low budget. It's like a, I agree with Uncle Michael where he said Juji fruit ones had more flavor. Like dots are just blah. That's the point. To get black candy, it's delicious because it's it's a so bad it's good candy. Oh my god! You know. Like, I guess if you're looking for what's the worst of the worst, keep the dots. Yeah, you're in. Oh, it's better than buns. No, Runs kicked the crap out of that. They have so much more flavor. Runs are good, um, but I do like dots. Yeah. Well, there you go. There is another candy review from Ryan. One of these days, we'll go back out and get real food, but he keeps telling me he doesn't want to go anywhere, so we keep doing all the reviews we have here at the house. So hit that like button, hit the subscribe, yep. hit the comment, and tell him that he needs to go out and do something better. Yeah, what do you want to see? Tell us. You know, because I've been trying to get them. There's a lot of stuff out there right now. A lot of it's old now compared to, you know, when it first came out. But um, some of it falls under the category of we're probably not going to do these anymore. So uh, do what? Like some of the some of the TGI brands. Fridays? Yeah, like TGI Fridays. And, yeah. I mean, we can. If, if, if you want us and, to see TGI Fridays or Muya, which we've had some like. Um, not so good. well, not so bad. For no me. bad. We had bad reviews. But compared to everything else, they're probably the worst place. Yeah, no, we've, ever we've, we've had they were they're either overcooked they're or consistently undercooked. Or... Bad. It's not that they're inconsistent because some of the inconsistent places are good. Right. We've had consistently bad products from them, which we is kind had, of disappointing. Because yeah, I so. remember, you know, liking TGI Fridays. Yeah, I never really did, but and now I just like them less. I remember that I sat in the stool at a TGI Fridays once. Uh, yeah, I think you think of a pub ninety nine. We were down no, the cake. no, we we were at the stool. It was just me and you. We we hopped in to get food, and uh, I sat on the stool because they wouldn't put us in the. You said, "Nah, you're not baby. You're not going in the in the cushion seats or whatever the the comfy yeah. seats." Me and you have never gone to TGI Fridays by ourselves. We've yeah, gone yeah. to Pizzeria Uno. Is the only place we stopped at. No, but we sat on the stool one time. No. Somebody was supposed to come meet us, and they never did. And we sat on that stool and ate the food on the on the stool that was like this tall. Remember, because I could barely get on the stool. I don't think he's thinking of this. I think we're talking. I, I think you're thinking of when we went to Pizzeria Uno. Did I sit on the stool there? Yeah, I think so. 
after the dentist. I don't think I sat on a stool there. I don't know. I don't know what he's talking about. I think he's making it up. I, we've never stopped. I can tell you, I have never paid at a TGI Fridays. Your mother have taken me a couple times. Other than when we did these reviews, I've never gone to a Fridays because I've never cared for Fridays. I always thought it was an overpriced, cheap. I mean, when there's so many other restaurant. options, just go someplace better. We always go to Applebee's, which is next door, and I TGI Fridays. We, me and you have never stopped, so I don't know what you're talking about. Like I don't I, remember where the stool. The was, only place but I, I sat remember on ever it. going where it was just me and you. We we actually we sat at Uno's. at Uno's after your dentist, and I ate the whole pizza. Yeah, you did, and you go to me and eat the I last ate, piece. Well, I ate. Like equal sizes yeah. to you, and you no, weren't right. gonna eat the that last one. No, was that, that, that was because we had all we had two different things. Yeah. But that yeah. was the only place I think me and you actually went when your mother wasn't around. But as we we didn't go to we went restaurant. to Uno's twice, but you only see one review on the channel um, of Uno's. Yeah, we went a couple times. We bought the same thing. We twice. bought the same pizza. And, and if twice. it's any consolation, we gave it a bad review two times. So. Oh, it was like a mediocre, like yeah, it was just okay, but it was one price. of the worst deep dish pieces I ever had. That was that was my. Review. I don't think it tasted terrible. It was bad. I think it was just and it was the thin, price is so high. And it was expensive, and it wasn't the price worth. Is so having. high, it's yeah. Not anywhere close to where it is. I believe we said we would go to Caesars seven times before we go back. I there. love Little Caesars. They don't have anything new. So, all right. Leave a comment down below what you'd like to see. Yeah. Uh, tell Ryan to get out of the house so we can actually go get something. Uh, hey, I've been getting out of the house. I wanted office. the spicy pizza from Pizza Hut, even though our Pizza Hut sucks, but he Oxygen just will healthy. not go. I think. I wanted the spicy flounder. He will not go. <laughs> Abby's has stuff. Applebee's has stuff. Taco actually, Bell. Dairy Queen just came Dairy out with Queen. stuff. Taco Bell has stuff. Um, so leave a comment down below if Where you want to see something besides them? cereal and candy because that's all okay, we have at the house there's been a lot of new cereals coming out we still got six more downstairs so get ready they're coming the, the only the cereals we have we have four more and three of them i wanted to try and he won't let me do those well we have one that's like pancake that, exactly that's the one he's going to make me do next it's not going to be one of the good ones that that'll they be actually tomorrow make. yeah probably well, um, so there you go. Yeah. Leave a comment down below. And if you want to see a cook, by all means, tell him because yeah, I've been us. trying to get him to do them too. Do I actually, I will be cooking tomorrow because I actually have a huge pork butt and stuff, Ooh. but we've already done poppers and I, I bought stuff for jalapeno poppers. We love so the poppers. The bacon wrap jalapeno the best poppers, thing ever made. Um, we've already made them on a the channel. So I keep trying to tell him to pick something so we yeah. can make something else. But we, I cook all the time, but he, he hasn't been in the mood. So if you want to see something different. Leave a comment down below. We'll try to get to it. And uh, we've gone on long enough. Thanks for watching. Check out his channel. Oh, it's Cash Flow Mash. It's in the description. Yeah, fun over there too. And actually, if you watch it, I, I, we're actually doing it. I, I just, we crashed so many videos. There's going to be one a day all the month of J April, pretty much. We're going to come out one a day with one of them. And even we, though we're recording on April Fool's, this is not a joke. Because it's yeah. not being uploaded. This is April Fool's Day, but it won't be on April Fool's Day yeah. when it comes out. But, uh, yeah, for the month of April, Less Cash, More Mash, we're going to be pumping out one a, one a day there, too. Because me and uh, Uncle Michael have been banging out videos like crazy to get some content out there. So go ahead and watch us if you want to. Uh, hit the subscribe button over there. We greatly appreciate it. Definitely subscribe over here because I know it's less than 50% that are actually watching mm, and subscribe. Yeah, but bad. Those that are watching, I appreciate thanks for watching. watching. I am bad like that myself, but uh, let's try to get better. I, I said the resolution this year was to get better at subscribing to people, and I have. I got a ton yeah. of subscriptions now. So vacations through the roof. Through the roof, and it's driving me nuts because I feel obligated to watch them when they come out. But uh, there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video.